Time to get puppies onto some soft food. Give mum some relief. She's getting pulled down pretty good. They are four and a half weeks old. And what we've got here is, this is puppy formula, life's abundance. But it's hard, little beast pieces, but it's too hard. And this would choke a puppy. So what we've done is we put it in a bowl and let it sit for four hours in some hot water. And then we've taken a fork and just mushed it up. So just mushed it up like this. You can still see, for instance, right there where I'm pointing, you can see there's still a little piece right there. But it's soft. If I take that piece of my finger and squish it, you can see that it's all soft. It's not going to choke a puppy. So that's what we're going to feed them. We'll see how they'll do with this. Um, now, when you introduce this to your puppies, if mum's present, be careful, because mum may not like the babies eating out of her bowl, and she could get aggressive. Now, it's not going to be a problem with Phoebe. She's not going to do that. Um, they've already been nibbling on her bowl of Bill Jack quite a bit. Already they've got teeth, uh, so they can handle it. And also, I'd like to say, mum's not going to be aggressive towards her. So, but, yeah, still but, yeah, so what Tammy's saying here is, especially the first few times you do this, don't leave your, even if mums get along with them, don't leave them alone because you could get a puppy that gets choked a little bit and then you can just step in there and get that out of their throat. So don't just blindly just let them get on with it. Monitor the whole situation. All right, so Tammy, you ready for this? Not, Not quite yet. Okay, we're, it's in the morning and we're just doing a little tidy up because they've, uh, they're still with mum all the time, 24 seven. And mum's just been out to poop. So we're gonna start off with them just being introduced with this without mum. Uh, Phoebe, there's Phoebe out here waiting on us. Hey Phoebe, where are you? She's wandered off. I need a new Okay. I'll get it. I'll get it. Here's Phoebe. Now you can see she's getting a bit skinny, her backbone showing. So this is why it's time. She's, she's absolutely, absolutely looking after her babies, but it's time to uh, give her some a bit of relief. All right, babe. You better watch it. Oh, yeah. oh, don't you get me. This is Tammy's no, morning ritual. Say hi to the babies. Me. They oh, love oh, the attention. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh love goodness the attention. Then you say, oh, goodness, <laughs> take love. Goodness All right, ready for some food? Yeah. All right. Here we go. Let's see how they do. I'm just going to plunk this in the middle down here. See what they think of that. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> he just pounced on it. Do you see that? Yeah, so they, <laughs> they've been eating mum's bill jack, so they kind of, uh, they they can smell it and realize it's, well, it's good stuff. There they are, they're just all just knocking away. And they've been away. letting us know that they're more than ready to, to have food because they've been white, uh, extra little whinier. Okay. They're not getting satisfied. So mama's milk is probably not as... Not as and Plentiful as it was. Keeping her more full down. Than yes. Yeah. Yes. So you can see this is going really well. So how long do you feed them for? Oh, five, ten minutes. Um, they can gorge themselves, so just watch out for that. Especially the first few times. You don't want them getting a complete change of diet and getting an upset stomach. So just take it easy. Just to, you know. And then the other thing to watch out for is you can be in a situation where... Maybe most of your puppies are engaging with the food and really enjoying it, but one puppy's just not. And um, in that situation, be careful, because if you take mum away, that puppy may not be getting food. So, so you can see this little girl here, she's more intent on seeing what, loves mama. what mum's doing. She loves mama. As yes, opposed to does. enjoying her food. So that'd be an example of, of a situation where um, <laughs> You can have a puppy that's just not getting food, so. Oh, somebody uh, wants to eat the bowl. Yeah, well, they're teething, aren't they? Yes, they're yeah, teething. They're teething, so that's, and then, okay. then the next thing is, is you can get in a situation where one of the puppy gets right in the middle of the bowl. And what works really well is a kind of a bunt dish where you've got that raised central portion and that stops puppies getting in it. They're not doing that here, so that's okay. But if they start doing that, just use a bunt dish so that they don't have a temptation to uh, get right inside it. Because you know it, it stops other puppies getting to it, and also you know you just don't want puppies who've been stepping on maybe poop then putting it in the food. It's not uh, it's not not ideal. And see what I do to cut down smell. I'll put the pee pads and the wipes in a Walmart yes. trash bag or grocery trash bag, and then I will put it into a plastic bag. Yes, right. So what, what are we changing bedding out here twice a day at this point? I don't know. 
more? Uh, yeah, because they're peeing a lot. Yeah, right. They're drinking water. So the, so the next problem you're going to run into is when you do this, their poop changes. And then mum may not be eating, eating and picking up their poop anymore, and you may be doing all of it. So you could be at a bigger mess when that goes on. All right, so these two guys, they've kind of had enough for right now. And uh, the little girl wasn't eating, and she's back to eating again. She's more playing. So we just got uh, Pavarotti there, who's uh, wanting to... And, of course, they smash it down, so you've got to... Loosen it up. Loosen it back there up. There you go. Okay, yep. Oh, I know, I know. But nobody's showing any signs of uh, choking or anything. <laughs> okay, okay. Yes, I will come here and get you loving. I know. You get you loving, yeah. Yeah. Okay, little girl, you need to eat. You hand me. Oh, no, that's sake. Shall we let mom in and see how she does mm. it? Yeah, I'll okay. go get her in. All right, let's see how mom does. Yeah. So, I think that mom's just not going to interfere with them. Let's let them get on with it. Here she comes. Pops in. Hi, mama. Hey, mama. She wants to know what's going on here. Okay. Yep, she just let him get on with it. Yeah. And, they, and now she's going to get attacked by the puppies. <laughs> See, they still want mama. She still yep. has milk. Yeah, so what's the transition? It's going to be um, feed them like this. Then we will uh, take mama away during the daytime and only let mama be with them at nighttime. And then eventually mum's not with them at all. But you've got to give mum a chance to dry up. You can't just... Take her away, cold turkey, because she'll, she'll, she's got to have that milk drain. So, you know, give her an opportunity to do some feeding, do a transition. <laughs> See this guy down here, just going to chew on mum's leg. And then mum just steps in there and has a little bit to eat. So, you know, what, what we typically do is, is keep mum out of the, of the pen while the babies are feeding. And then when they've had about eight, ten minutes of it, then put mum in there and she can finish up what's left. Mama, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll fix your own bow so you'll get everything you need. I'll, I'll fix your own bow here in a minute. But she's not being insistent, is she? No. She's just, she's just a good, she's no. a good, she's a really good mama. That's, no, no. She's not knocking puppies out of the way. No. She's kind of moving around to find a place to go in, but she'd like oh, to eat no. too. you'd like to eat that. I'll let her eat some. There you go. Because they've, they've really had about enough done, don't you think? No. No? Okay. Especially well, little, my little girl. Yeah. Yes, right. She needs a bit more. Yeah, she's. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pavarotti, you're gonna get big and fat, little girl. Little girl, come here. Come here. Okay, let let the babies have some more. Let the babies have some more. Don't you be biting me? Don't you be biting me? <laughs> I do. <laughs> All right, so there we go. So remember, moisten the food. Now you can use puppy mousse. We used to use Royal Canine puppy mousse. It's even more liquidy, and it's really a good place to start. So if your if your baby's having a bit of problems, uh, you might try the uh, Royal Canine puppy mousse. You could even mix it with uh, some goat's milk and make kind of a slurry out of it, and make it kind of a soup or a gruel. Uh, that's a good way if you start this earlier. Why would you start it earlier? Maybe mum's milk's failed, and you've got to do all the milk, all the feeding yourself, and you're okay. ready to take a break. Okay, mum. Or mum's mum's getting really skinny, or mum doesn't want to feed her babies anymore because they're scratching her up. All those would be reasons to get to doing it sooner than, than four and a half weeks. What's the earliest you can start doing this, Tammy? Get it three and a half weeks. Uh, yeah, whenever they have their well, you can. Uh, make it real soupy where they're three weeks and they could eat it. So, so if you're in a, if you're pressed for it, you need to do it three weeks. And it needs to be soupy. Where raw, they just raw canine yeah. puppy mousse mixed with uh, with, mixed with goat's milk. They're just coming in at yep. three three make, and a half. Weeks. Make a gruel out of it. Yeah. Yeah. So they don't have to. Yeah. No. They have to have the teeth. Let them eat it. Let them eat it. I've got your food. I'm gonna fix her food. Okay. She's gonna all right. This all. Well, well, that's it for this. So you can see they've eaten. What are they eating? Half of it. Uh, no, she has. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. we needed to put her food in at yeah. the same time. Yes. Right. Yeah. Let her go. Let's see what she does. Just for the heck of it. No, because she will. Okay. 
No, not really. Come with me. Come on, come on, Mama. Come on, I'll fix your food. Mama, come here. I know their food is neat. Come on. So show us her food, Tabby. Okay. Bill Jack. It's in the frozen section. We buy it at Walmart, super, supermarkets. Um, you cannot get it west of the Rockies. So if you're looking for it and you live in California, you're just not going to find it. But there, that's that's what we feed. It's it's frozen food. It's very it's soft, and uh, it really helps moms. Have <laughs> the little puppies want to get into it too. Yeah. Let me <laughs> like, move her more back. Do they this like way. that better? So it's well, not really puppy formula, is new. it? Yeah, it's no, not. It's not really not, puppy formula. No. Which I think it's probably got less protein than what the uh, puppy feed is. But I don't know that's right. And, and I mean, I don't think you're not going to do anything wrong with it. Yeah. Um, but if you if you put in regular food that was not moist, that that would not be a good thing because you definitely get a puppy choked on that. Three ring circus, isn't it? Yes. See, Mum's just been pretty good, isn't she? You a pretty good mama. She's just gonna let them feed. Mm -hmm. They really like that bill jack. Yeah, I know, but it's not for them. Uh, they'll be on life of the oak. Somebody's doing a nice job for you. Oh, poop. Yeah, yeah it looks yeah. good. Yeah. Nice turds. Yep. You like that? Yeah. That's a show, breeder's show that, show that's, that that's a breeder's dream. That's right. Nice firm, <laughs> firm, nice colored, firm turd. Uh, so, you know, this is the other thing. Wormy dogs. Two, four weeks yes. with parental pair mate, Nemex 2, and then six, eight, ten weeks or every two weeks with uh, Safeguard for three days in a row when you use that product. Um, but you can see mums, you're going to go in there and maybe just have a little nibble uh -huh. on that stuff. No, they really like the build that. That's interesting. I know, but it's... That's why we're going to transition her over. So this is why we use the build jet for mum. They, they, they like it. I mean, it's good stuff. Mm-hmm. It good is. Stuff. It's good stuff. Not cheap. It's $10 a bag no. for a five-pound bag. Yeah. But, but, I mean, it's... Nah. It's not... In the scheme of things, it's not a big deal, is it? Tammy's trying to get that interest. <laughs> <laughs> She's losing the battle. That could be a good selling product yeah. for uh, yeah, Bill Jack. Yeah, Bill Jack, yes. Yeah. Your dogs, four out of, four, three out of four dogs prefer Bill Jack. Is that the there that goes? Rattled me because I'm moving from that. <laughs> Sit down, Mama. No, I know. You That's funny. She like wants the different she stuff. Wants, yeah. She wants to look at this guy in the back. He's got the bowl up in the because air. Because it's new. <laughs> look at uh, uh, Bollicelli. He's got it worked out. That's funny. Come on. Mama, come on. Let's go. Mama. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Still got our heated whelping kit going. Oh, no, we don't. It's turned off. That's fine. I guess we're at the point now where they don't need it. What was that? That was control. Well, Tammy trying to get them to eat this food here, yes. and they, they, they want the, I think they're about full. I think that they're, anyway, there we go. <laughs> Anything else to add to it, Tammy? No, just okay. uh, give me a shout. Yes. Throw my so who, in there. Yes. So look at this ear taping. This ear is still a little bit floppy, but it's not we'll too bad. We'll put it back up. Yep. His ears look a lot better, don't oh, they? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. Oh, his teeth are a lot better. I yep. know that. Yep. Here, here's your toy. Here's your toy. Chew that. That's what I got these toys in for, for you to chew that up. Can you speak to me this morning? And I think yeah. everybody, here is, everybody here is everybody here has spoken yeah. for. We're waiting for the, the yeah. deposit to go yeah. through on Bocelli That's here. He's a good boy. He's a mute. He's a good boy. Tell Mama. You look like you want to talk to me. I know you do. I know you do. Look at, look at uh, Rossi. Oh, such a good boy. Oh, yes, you talk to me. You talk to me. Yes, you will. Yes, you will. Oh, goodness sake, I love you. Yeah. I, mm, kiss. Oh, that's a good kiss. <laughs> that's a good kiss. Mm. Oh, they're so precious. They are. They are. They are. Yeah. 
until when they get bigger and bigger messes. Yes, sir. Somebody said they didn't have good structure. <laughs> they don't know what they're looking at. Okay. Uh, no, don't, even, <laughs> don't even react to it. Don't even react I to know. it. Everybody can make their own choices here. Yeah, everybody's got a different eye pill, folks. Yeah, yeah. 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 In Mama's yeah. eyes, they're perfect. They yes, are. they are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Good babies. Good babies. Yeah. Well, you like them so much, you're going to keep a little girl. Oh, so that's I know. Just something right there. I know. I know. They're precious babies. See what Mandy Pilgrim thinks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. She's the owner of the stud that's the daddy yes. to these babies. Right. Okay, yeah. we've got way too many minutes into it. Bye, everybody.